Bobby, we want to know how things are going. Oh, where's the shrimp? Oh, wait, let me try this. Um, so Bobby is cooking. She got me cooking. No, we were cooking. Then I was like, oh, I feel dizzy. I feel dizzy. Oh, no. I wasn't she ready. Lying. She I, wasn't, lying. I wasn't ready. I wasn't she ready, lying. right? And so she's making her favorite dish. Well, we're making her favorite dish. It's um Japanese curry. And it's not a difficult dish. And we use this. You got to go to the Japanese market to get this. And she could take some back to school with her. And so she got her braids done. She got her eyebrows done. She met up with her friends. Had her little reunion. You have to see my mommy. But you know what's weird, y'all? And don't come for me for this. Don't come for me. Yes, you are taller. But don't come for me, please. When I went away to college... When I came home to surprise my mother, that was the last time I saw her. No, we're not owning up to that. I'm just seeing what happened. That's the last time. So it's just like when certain things in life repeats itself, it just makes you think about it. So, I and I did, I did, no, but I knew you were going to come. But I did um, make an appointment to go see the doctor just to get everything checked out. Pay, pay, sis, pay. So, this is what our curry is doing right now. It still needs time to cook, Bobby. So, Bobby, we want to know how has college been? Are you getting used to it? What's going on? Tell us. Definitely. Give us the tea. Shoot. Um, college has been good. I like it. Um, because I'm doing... Ooh, I don't know. It's, uh, don't use names. I'll touch on it. Okay. Um, but it's been good because, as you guys know, I'm going um, and I'm playing basketball there as well. So I'm kind of juggling school and basketball and, you know, living. But it's fun because it's like I automatically went there with 14 friends. So. It's so there's 14 people on the team? 15 of us. Oh, it's 15 total? Mm -hmm. So I, I do have a question for you. Okay. And we could cut this out if you want. But how do you feel as though your abilities are compared to the other team members? And I know everybody plays a different position, but do yeah. you feel like you are up to par with everyone else? I mean, it's definitely like different. It, but it's not as like throw you in the water as I thought it was going to be. It's kind of a lot of teaching too. Like. Mm -hmm everything we've been doing is like teaching like they teach us as if we've like kind of never played basketball before because it's like a whole new kind of thing so it's like i'll have like post workouts and it's like learning like moves and stuff and like repetition with like moves so it's like and it's like we're all kind of just like learning how to do everything but i don't know i feel like it'll be because i'm playing behind people like there's this girl I don't know how it's gonna play out with her because she has something wrong with her feet. Um, so she hasn't been practicing and playing much. But I don't know. We'll just see. What do you mean playing behind people? Like everybody, if you're a freshman, you go in and you play behind people. Like there's seniors, there's juniors, uh, there's people who's been there longer than you. Like you're gonna go to college, there's gonna be somebody better than you because it's a whole nother level of playing. Mm -hmm. So it's just gonna. So like, do you take think time. you're gonna get playing time? I mean, we'll see how it goes by like the end of the year. Like it's still like. I'm still just learning everything. Yeah. And it's like, it, it, practice is just like learning everything. So like, we'll see. And if freshmen usually don't get a lot of playing time, unless you're like a different breed of player. Um, but I think over time, like definitely will, definitely will. But I'm still learning everything. Everything is still like just learning thing going in there. But, um, so are you getting along well with your roommate, your other teammates? Yeah, I I love them all. Well, <laughs> I your hair girl. I like um I can't see the camera so. I like all of my um everybody's really are nice. Are you still on the camera? Yeah, I'm, everybody's really nice. Um Everybody's really nice and it's like all of my teammates and I like we all get along really well, so it's um no, it's been nice. It's like we're like a good group of like a group of us. 
So that yeah. has there been any drama on the team? Well, yeah, like when um when I got there, um it's like a stricter environment just because of how they lost their season last year because of Corona. They were like going to like the semifinals, I think, and they couldn't go because of Corona. So that was rough for them. So they're super strict on Corona. So stuff happened when I got there. Um, that's just I didn't know about. Like we can't really do much. We just can't really do much out there because of Corona. But it's all like, um, oh my God, I forgot the shrimp. It's all a lot better now. Now that they're like, because my coach kind of got on my team about it a little bit, but. That's all just in the past, um, but there was some drama in the beginning when I first got there, but your eyes are... I do. But it's good now. Um, but it's good. I actually, I like it up there. Um, I like it up there a lot. Workouts are... Workouts are killer. Um, they're so hard. Um, but let me tell y'all this. Let me tell you something. Listen, 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 listen. Let me interject, okay? Bobby came home. Right? So she came home Friday. And then Saturday, I'm like, it's kind of quiet in here. Where's Bobby? I was like, where are you? Baby, do you know she went to her personal trainer to, to work out? I'm like, you just had killer workouts at school. I was just going back today, but I couldn't. Well, I could but we're doing dinner and i was like you were doing workouts at school killer workouts workouts that are geared towards what the navy you said well that was just this one workout it was kind of like a military boot camp type workout and that baby got up and went to work out on her own with her personal trainer tell me that's not dedication because baby i can tell you i wouldn't have been home trying to do nobody's workout but Bobby is a different breed. <laughs> and she's always gonna push us out. And I should have been on that treadmill tonight. So you can walk. You wanna go to the um, track? And we can walk the track to walk dinner off? We can. Um, they literally say the, it only takes like two days to get out of shape and there you can't. Are you serious? Yeah, you can't afford to get out of shape there unreal literally our track workout but that is something like if like i started playing basketball late so i i go into places knowing i'm not going to be the best player on the planet in there i'm not going to be no lebron james or anything but one thing i do know is that i can excel on a track <laughs> i can excel on a track i'm not the strongest so excelling in the weight room isn't my thing either but on the track i got you so i'd be working on that track I work on the track. But overall, I have class I've had classes for about two weeks now. Oh, how about classes? Not bad. There I go to a small school, so it's small class sizes. Like it's just like I'm a, I'm in high school. Like they're small class sizes. Like you know your professors, like they know my name. Oh they do? Yeah. They know you on a basketball team? Mm, not all of them, no. Mm-hmm. Do you have to have uh, ever have to wear your uniform? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. And so tell tell them what do you have to do as far as your uniform? I mean, as far as um, I don't know. We just have like rules, so like for classroom wise. Yeah, you got to be. I have to be to class five minutes early, and I have to um, sit in front of the class the front two rows of the class and they do classroom checks so our academic coach our academic assistant coach um she will come around to your classes and check to make sure you're in class oh class really time. yeah i thought on friday they did them a lot on friday they did everybody on friday because they didn't want you skipping class well so, is it customary or like the norm to skip class on fridays well a lot of people would have skipped because everybody was going home and if you had a 12 o'clock class, it's like, I don't want to go to that. Like, I want to go home. And your teachers give you absences. Like, I get, like, 
five free absences in one class, two free absences in one class, like an absence with no questions asked. Oh. Because in college, once you get a certain amount of absences, they can drop you from the class. They can drop you from the class. Really? Mm -hmm. But we're not allowed in this class. That's a no go. That's a hard no. But rice has the food, bro. All right, all right. <laughs> breakfast, breakfast, bang it. Breakfast never disappoints because we have an omelet bar, so it's kind of like a Chipotle. They have everything. You pick what you want in your omelet. They'll put it in a bowl, and then they throw it on this. Uh, like this big, what's it called? Like a big cooked stove top, like a griddle, like a big griddle. And then they'll saute everything up, and then eggs, omelet, cheese on top, salsa on the side, Tabasco. They recently ran out of Tabasco, it's kind of disappointing, but whatever, whatever. I get jalapenos on my thing now, so. You can pick one of those Tabascos. I got Tulu in my room. Okay. Blueberry muffins. So, Bobby, you may want to consider doing egg whites to cut down a little. I can't. Why? That's not an option. Ooh. That's not an option. But I, I literally eat an omelet every day. Mm -hmm. I eat one like four, three to four times a week. Two to four times a week. You don't get tired of them? No. <laughs> no. No. No, I love eggs. I love omelets. But they're not that good for you, Bobby. I like eggs working for you. Not too many because filled with cholesterol. Cholesterol is through the roof. Mm -hmm. Cholesterol is probably through the roof. I can't. But, but then again, you work out a lot. Yeah, and eggs are like protein. It's good for you, right? <laughs> I'm trying to find a picture of one of my omelets. Um, lunch, never go to the dining hall. That's no go, no go. Um, because it's just like a salad. Okay, the salads, the salads are okay. And they get boring because this is, it's, the dressing is just okay. And you gotta bring your own dressing. I know, I know, I know. This omelet doesn't look that good, but. <laughs> So you just got my cheese on top, that's my Tabasco, and I get my salsa on the side. Whoa, I'm close now. Um, and it's like me and my, my teammates and I, like, we're all like, we have a good time today. Well, my roommates, my roommates, my teammates, and then the girl who was upstairs. The five new people. We have a group chat. We're like, what are we doing for breakfast? Like, cat on for breakfast, question mark. What are we doing for lunch? We do everything together, like. Which I like. Uh, and see, the one thing I do like is that Bobby went to school and she had an automatic, you know, support system friend group. So do you like your coach or your coach tough? I like my coach. I think she likes me. And then they have a bunch of like hole in the wall restaurants around town. Because I live, I go to school in a small town. It's like there's nothing out there but a Walmart and a Taco Bell. Kind of rough out there but the sushi spots if you guys don't know i love sushi sushi is like my favorite thing on the planet and i'm like oh i'm not gonna be able to eat sushi wrong look at this sushi oh that's pretty deep fried so good it was so good it's a it was like they fry it and it was good. That does look good. It was good. This is an Arkansas roll with no avocado. Banging. And then, of course, we have a Chick fil A on campus. And then this other place where I can use my meal swipes. So, food situation is not as bad as I thought. I, was, I thought I was going to be starving for four years. But, mm. but it's not that bad. It's not that bad. So, do I, you work out every day? Oh, yeah. Like two to three times. We have like. I'll have like, on Mondays are my hardest days. Cause Mondays I'll have 6 a.m. conditioning. Sometimes I'll have an 8 a.m. class, 10 a.m. class. Are you able to oh, shower when you have the early morning? It depends. 
if we're on the track sometimes i just gotta go straight there because we get out at like 7 30 i gotta be i gotta leave 15 minutes early so it's like i don't really have time but i do you walk to all your classes yeah mm -hmm. yeah so you know your way around now mm -hmm. i thought i would never know my way around but i got it after like a week a couple days because mm -hmm. i'm really only in two buildings oh really I'm only in two buildings. Everybody in their first year is kind of in McBride, which is like, everybody's just in that building. So all my classes are in that building or the science building. So they're right next to each other too, so there's no confusion. Like, it's just easy. Um, do you think they do that purposely for freshmen? Um, yeah, like a lot of freshman classes are in McBride because a lot of freshmen, you gotta take your prerequisites. Like everybody's mm -hmm. gonna take, get their, those classes out of the way. So, but you went to school with some credits, boo. I did. I did. So, I already went with some credits, so I like... Uh, but my roommate, she's like a sophomore. She's like a sophomore. Erica? Mm -mm, not my roommate, sweetie. Allie. She's like a sophomore. I think Bethany is too. Oh, really? Yeah, they went in with a lot of credits. Oh, so they smart. I don't know what I am. I don't. I don't know how many credits I went in with, honestly. But it's like, either way, if you whatever amount of credits you go into, like you're still gonna end up like taking the same amount of. Like we all have the same amount of classes. And, like we all have the same amount of hours. Mm -hmm. But because they won't just like let you sit around your freshman year, you gotta keep it going. Mm -hmm. So we are so excited to have a home, but. This is the longest she's been home since she got home. So I was like, oh, you gonna be out with your friends or are we gonna eat? And I, so we thought about going out to eat, but she eats, it's almost like she eats out every day. So it's not like she's getting home cooked meals. Not that I cook a lot, but I felt as though, you know, she wanted to eat something that she likes at home. And so when we said the Japanese curry, she was all over that and plus, She'll have something to take with her, and then I'm making um, sweet potato pies. She could take that back with her, and I might make some chocolate cupcakes. My nice. friends would love that. Yes, for her to take for friends. I have made them so much that I can eat one and I'm done. I've made them since they've been little kids. <laughs> so mm -mm. she could take all that back with her. My friend would love that. She loves all that. Erica? No. So Bobby had all her friends over here <laughs> on Friday. I did. <laughs> what time did everybody leave? Oh, uh, well, we had left. We went to Jada's. So Bobby, you meet any boys? Uh, Nobody you talking to? I mean, people try, but hmm? people try. Um, I talk to some people like occasionally. Like, I was talking to this one guy for a minute, but we just like recently stopped talking. Why? It, I, I don't even know to be honest. It was kind of stupid. Rice. Oh, I guess we have to mm -hmm. We want to know. I don't like talking about this stuff on camera. <laughs> I don't like talking about this kind of stuff. Your aunties, your uncles, we want to know. It's, it, we just stopped talking. Like we talked for a little bit. We stopped talking for like stupid stuff. Like I don't, I don't even really know why. I said what I had to say, and I guess he didn't like what I had to say. So. We oh well. Talking. Next call up. We stopped talking. But it is what it is. I'm not gonna chase nobody, so. Uh huh. I'm. But I'll come back to the kind person. He in one of my classes too.